Guys, today's the day. The day I give birth. It's my it's my birthday. No, wait. My birthday? It's my baby's birthday. Either way, today we're having a baby. Can't you tell? Look at it. It's in my... Well, it's meant to be in my... Is it even in my stomach? Either ways. I don't know, okay. But um, at any second now... Well, okay. This second right now. Welcome. <laughs> Oh gosh. Okay. Okay. I gotta get out of here. Um, oh gosh. I can't move. Wait, 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 wait. I can't move. I can't move. All right. Chill out, little guy. Chill out. You're my little child. Stop nibbling on my toes. Um, hold on a second. <laughs> oh, my armor. My, I, I'm so unprepared for this, guys. Okay. No, no, no. Oh, wait. Shut up. No, no. Stop. 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 Stop it. Stop it. Please. Stop it. Stop it. Wait. No. Just, just. I need it. I can't jump. I gotta get off the floor. <laughs> guys, welcome back. Welcome back. Why can't I jump? Welcome back to our mega modded survival. We've just given birth to what I hope is the savior of our series progression. My little Reaper baby. My little alien baby is sitting right in there. Um, although I can't really see him. Oh no, I can kind of he's kind of right there. You can kind of see him under the chair. Hold on. Can I not like yeah, there he is. There he is. He's in there. He's sitting under my bed. He's ready to he's literally under my bed. I gotta get a better view of this. Hold on. I don't wanna like let him out. We gotta be very, very careful. These guys are quite aggressive in their infantile state, but there he is. He's ready to nibble on the toes of whoever sets their little foot down next to the bed. You hop out of the bed. You ever have little nightmares where you have oh, I'm not even gonna go there. I know that there is a uh there can be a younger age demographic on these videos. I don't want to traumatize any of you. Uh, but yes, we've done it. We've given birth. Yesterday, we fell pregnant to the Reaper Queen. Let me get this helmet off. Um, and uh, well, yeah, what results soon after that is giving birth to a little Reaper baby. Now, today, we're going to let this guy grow up. We're going to level it up. And we're going to see if it is able to kick the butts of, well, some of the bosses that we're going to be seeking out soon. Because that's kind of the point we're at. I have three bosses out there that need taken down. Tempest, the flying... We we actually haven't seen Tempest this series yet. We'll cross we'll cross that guy's path eventually. We've got Spinebreaker, the Spino, who shoots cannons and has got some ball of death thing. And then we've also got Skana, the metal... Um, the scorpion yeah thing that knocks anything out that gets anywhere near it now unfortunately i don't think any of my dinosaurs have what it takes to take it down um we have some pretty strong beings also you may notice my dinosaurs are all over the shop right now i accidentally hit the j everybody follow me button and now they're all well I'm trying to do exactly that um they're all over the shop more so than they were normally which is pretty bad already also i got like literally now we've got T-Rexes in here now, but all of us, yeah, this place is just ridiculous. But anyways, we need somebody strong, and I'm starting to doubt all of my tames, and that's where I'm hoping this little baby comes into it. So, we're going to wait for it to grow up, we're going to jump on its back, we're going to take it for a spin, um, but unfortunately, for the time being, I can't really do anything because, well, he's a little aggressive little fella. So, uh, while we wait for that, I'll ask you guys at home. If you do enjoy the video, please go ahead, punch that thumbs up. Make it rain those thumbs ups. If you haven't yet done so, subscribe to the channel. Or if you're looking for some Mr. Miola merch, head over to MrMiola.com. Anyways, that's about it. I think what I'm going to do is pay him a little visit very quickly. Make sure the door's shut behind me so he doesn't escape. And I just want to have a little peek at my little guy. My little baby. I just want to see how's he going in the old growth charts. There he is. 3.7%. Okay. Look, maybe um, I, I can't even... Oh, I can jump. I can jump. All right. We'll just sit up here for a minute. I'm just going to wait for him to grow up. That's what I'm going to do. <gasps> no, I got an idea. No, that sounds... That's a silly idea. That's a silly... Why would we sit around and wait when I have access to this thing here? I can open this guy up. I meant to be open. I actually can't open this guy up. Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? Hold on. Are you in the way or is it my refrigerator that I thought was so cleverly placed that I now need to move it? Is that in the way? All right, my T-Rex is stuck in my base regardless. Um, no, it's you. You're in the way, mate. Dang. Okay, that's really annoying. <laughs> I'm going to have to pick up my refrigerator. That's fine. It is what it is. I'll move you slightly over here. I'll then go ahead and grab all of the little items out of there. Plop them in here. There we go. All right. Now I can access this. And I should be able to craft us up a mutator. We're going to get said mutator. I'm going to take my mutator. I'm going to place my mutator. Eh, just over here. 
this little guy is not going to know what hit him. We got to place like five of this in there. And now what this can do is help our baby grow up nice and fast. So I'm going to change the mode. So it's the gender. Make some genderless. Grants nearby the ability of something or other. Something about imprinting. Stops nearby. No, I want to increase the aging. This one here causes nearby non-adult dinosaurs to grow more rapidly. All right, let's let out that element pulse. Any second. There it is. Now let's go and see how my little dude's doing. It's probably still at like 5%. But either ways, now he's going to grow up. Oh, he's a juvenile. Okay, I think that's good. I think that means now we're friends. I think that means he won't... Oh, gosh. He... Yeah, okay, cool. <laughs> uh, he's growing up really fast. All right, now I actually need to get him out of here. It's time to pull down some of these walls, I think. We may not... Well, I was literally going to say, let's go AFK for a minute and like, you know let him grow up might not need to do that anymore i think he will literally yeah i think he's, he's ready to join society um let's just get you to like some free space there's not a lot of free real estate inside the base mate so just i don't know pick a spot and let's just hope that all goes well okay i'll give you a little bit of a cuddle he's 100 percent imprint now apparently nice um and he's already 30 percent of the way there man that that mutator pulse really did its job Nice, that was so worth it. All right, well, cool. Uh, while you're sitting tight and you're just chilling here, what I'm going to do is hop over here. Um, do, do Reapers need saddles? No, I guess not. I guess they do not need saddles. Okay, that's good-ish, I guess. Okay, nice. Um, do we have like an armor or something I can put on him? I don't think so. Hell horse medieval armor. That actually sounds really cool, but no, I think we're okay. Um, great. Well, I guess I'll just wait for you to be the other 70% of the way there. Wow, it's 50% of the way there. Cool. And uh, we'll take our massive pink Reaper spawn out for a spin. I'm really excited about this one here. These Reapers from memory are really, really strong. So I'm hoping that this guy here follows in the footsteps of the ones before him. And hopefully, yeah, we go and kick some serious butt with him. There was always something, uh, sorry, there was also something a second ago that I just noticed. That's something we haven't, we've spoken about, but I never actually really looked into properly. And that's boss trophies. I never thought about how these here might actually help us make progress moving forward. Also, look at my inventory. It is a mess. Let's just go and um, we got junk and we got stuff that I should keep. I don't, I, I, it's hard to realize where one starts and the other stops, but actually I need that. I'll take that one there back. My inventory is an absolute disaster right now. Let's just drop that, that, actually, yeah, we got metal. We got all sorts on us. Yeah, that'll do. I guess that'll do. All right, at least now I could like move around. We don't have to like worry about being too heavy and all that. But this is what we need to look into, I think. This is what's going to give us that little bit of a little bit of a boost. Assuming that Reaper's good. You know what? Despite whether the Reaper's good or not, these things are going to be very, very helpful. Last time we looked into these, we didn't have this many available to us. But basically what they do is you can equip them to your dinosaurs and they give them a little bit of a special boost. For example, the Mothra's Trophy of Reflection um, reflects 10% of your damage taken onto your enemy very very well actually could be very very good um kraken the kraken one gives you a 20 percent hp bonus mr fistus fists gives your dinosaurs 50 percent 50 percent damage buff dude all right i gotta go kill another mr fister i think um the titanosaur means that you take 25 percent less damage triceratops oh it lets you summon in minions yeah that doesn't excite me too much and then you got this one over here which it heals your dinosaur by three by ten percent every three seconds which is actually really really good so i don't even know which ones i would target this is really intriguing because it's going to keep you your it's going to keep you healed basically which is pretty effective you then obviously got the fists which deal 50 percent damage extra damage that's going to be really really awesome too i wish you could stack them all but i'm pretty sure you can't the health bonus I don't know if that one there excites me, but this one here does. Reflecting damage. That sounds like a lot of fun. Uh, on that note, our Reaper's ready to go. So let's go and take him for a spin and see what we can do. Um, yeah. And then, you know what? Well, I guess we're going to know pretty soon if uh, I guess this Reaper holds any future with us. I'm not going to judge it straight away. Okay. We're going to, we're going to, in fact, you know what? Just so, just to, just to hide any judgment whatsoever, I'm going to hide the amount of damage we're dealing as we go around because i don't want to 
I don't want to lose faith in him just yet, basically. <laughs> if I see him stealing only 2,000 damage, I'm going to be really, really disappointed. I'm not ready to be disappointed like that just yet. So we're just going to run around. We're going to get him nice and leveled up. Uh, we're going to take a few things down. A few of the little, little easy targets around the place. So far, so good, though. We're one-shotting most things, which is a pretty promising feeling. Like, we are one-shotting. You want to see that. That's a good thing. That's a very, very nice thing to be seeing, as a matter of fact. Yeah, I kind of like this. I get the feeling my guy here is going to be a heavy hitter. Um, I don't know if I'm ready to unveil how much damage he's dealing yet. We'll just, we'll just get a few little levels up our sleep first, I think. But so far, so good. I like it. Let's go and tackle something a little bit stronger with a little bit more health. Bronte. Okay, he survived a hit, but still only a two-shotter. That's fine. That's fine. Brontos have quite a bit of health. They can have hundreds of thousands of health. So I'm not going to lose faith just yet. All right. You're going to be a three-hitter, aren't you? Nope, just a two-hitter. Okay, good, 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 good. We got 35 levels up our sleeve. I think I'm going to put some levels into health. Like half a million health, I think, would be a nice amount. I just went and, like, put all of them into health. Let's give him some movement speed. So we're not putting any into damage just yet. At least now he's moving around a little bit more freely. Um, i, I got to fight something that's going to, like, level us up nicely. And I'm looking at this zombie titan up here. I feel like he's going to be a, a nice old leveling guy. So let's hit you with some... Uh, ooh. Actually, well, actually I've got to be careful here because I don't really know how resistant this... Actually, you know, this guy should be quite resistant. He's a reaper after all. All right. Well, either ways, zombie titan here. Um, he putting up a bit of a fight, didn't he? Yeah, like a like a big old fight. Um, he's, he's somehow stomping me. Wow. Yeah, he's, he's all right. He's all right. Okay, okay. You know what? Let's just have a look. 65,000 damage. That's good. Um, also, wow, this guy's a beast. This guy's a real big beast. Dealing 10,000 damage per stomp. That's cool. This is going to give us some nice experience, I think. But I can't. I'm, 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 okay, I've got a good feeling now. got a good feeling. Not a lot of dinosaurs that we, like, by default, deal with this amount of damage. So we're on the right track. Like once, especially once we get some levels into melee damage, we will really know the full potential of my guy here. And um, well, yeah, that's exactly where these next 64 levels are going. Every single one of them is going into melee damage. Now is where we will find out the true potential. Or at least it's gonna it's gonna give us a bit of bit more of an idea of what this guy can accomplish. I am going to go somewhere. I'm gonna go to the desert. This isn't going to take me to the desert, but it's going to get me close to the desert. And once we're close to the desert, well, that's kind of where all the bosses spawn. So at least I'll be able to like, I don't know. Oh, you're a slow swimmer. Oh, you're a real slow swimmer. Oh, hold on. I swear I just saw a manticore wing. There's a, there's a primary manticore out here. Yes. Okay, that's good. That's awesome. All right, nice. I, oh, 95,000 damage. Nice, nice. Oh, he's dealing crazy torpor. All right, I got to be careful. I gotta be careful here. Oh, he's actually gonna... Oh, 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 come on. Okay, he's dead. He's dead. Never mind. Oh, he filled me up with like one third torpidity. Oh, that's actually worrying. Okay, have stuff in there. Let's get rid of that torpor bar. But we should have a stack of experience now. Let me just... Let me just get out of this area. All right, that was so lucky to stumble across that little primal monkey there. Let's take him down for some extra experience too. We got dire bears. We got a bunch of other junk. Okay, Floor, you're just going to change your texture on me. That's interesting. 127 levels. That's what I'm talking about. And you know where they're going. We're cranking up the melee damage. Every single little bit of it in there. And we'll see how we go after that. Now, what is the backup plan if old Reaper buddy here, you know, ain't, ain't got what it takes? That's a good question. I think we are going to have to, well, potentially revert back to the Dota Wyvern if this guy's a failure. We obviously got to go tame one. The thing is, and what I just realized while thinking in my head right this second is, the Dodo Wyvern that we had a while back, for one, he wasn't a max. Oh, 152,000. Okay. All right. We're going to avoid that manticore. I don't want to go anywhere near that manticore up there. But, hundred, sorry. What about he even saying? We had a Dodo Wyvern that kicked serious butt. The thing is, I had like 150 levels in its speed stat. We, like, cranked up its speed. We didn't even put, like, all of its levels into melee damage. And it was still an absolute beast. So I'm wondering now, <laughs> if we do go down that pathway, what it will end up at once we throw everything we have at its, like, damage stat. So that could be a really, really fun experiment to see how strong it ends up. 
Uh, we'll get there. I think we will get there. But in saying that, so far, this Reaper is meeting expectation. I like what I'm seeing so far. We've also got other attacks we haven't even used yet. All right, that was pointless. But we've got this one. That wasn't that crazy either. I think my guy's greatest ability is just going to be his bite. Unless he has... Now he just roars. I think he just roars. Okay. But so far, I like what I'm seeing. I would like to come across Primeval out here. That would be a really, really good just final little like stat buff, stat boost. Um, in fact, let's have a scan. Let's have a scan. Oh, hello. How are you doing? Uh, okay. Oh, he dead. All right, nice. Very good. We got any primevals nearby. Let's have a look, hey? Dead wyverns. Nope, they're both not. Phoenixes, they don't really spawn out here. The Megapithecuses do, though. There's one nearby. 6382. It's going to be up here. All right, let's pay him a visit. Uh, after I get these levels in. 6382. So we got the 60... Ah, oh, the manticores, though. I don't have enough speed to outrun one of these. He's already targeting me, too. Really? Is he? he? Might be okay. All right, let's cut it. Let's cut straight across. Ah, uh, they're back. They're back from their despawned vacation. Ah, uh, they're everywhere already. Oh, come on, man. Just let me. Can I just run it through? Oh, this is such a. If I, I hope I'm not making a mistake here. Yeah. Oh, I see the gorilla. Oh, we're surrounded by a giant. Oh no, no. I just need the gorilla. Uh, where'd the gorilla go? Ah, uh, the, they're just they're literally sporting around me as we speak. Ah, oh, no, they're everywhere. Okay. All right, I can outrun them on the ground. Maybe, oh gosh. Oh, no, 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 no. We gotta get out of here. All right, yeah, no, this place isn't safe. This place is far from safe. All right, we're out of here. All right, you survive this one, old Megapithecus. You survive this one, mate. I hate this place so much. <laughs> I hate this desert so much. It's a great source for boss killing, but it is a terrible source for surviving um, due to these stinking manticores. And for whatever reason, just dismounting me whenever they attack. And then obviously I die, my teams die, we all die. Everybody dies. It's just rinse and repeat over and over again. All right, I think I'm going to cut it through this way. I haven't given up on this area just yet. We're just going to have a quick little scan in a second, but I just want to make it to the water all right we're at least out of manticore alley so that's nice that's that's good that's very very good okay okay uh, this is a, this is a, okay this like we can just chill here for a second in fact some spinos and stuff that can be pretty good for experience to be honest or whatever it was that was in there that we just killed oh get a little primal dude here as well Yep, fire breathers. Come on, come on, buddy. Come over here, Wyvern. There we go. Look at this beautiful spino down here. See you later, mate. Okay, we should have some extra levels up our sleeve. 13 of them. Still got a lot to go, but that's that's a good start. That's a good start. I like it. I like what I see. So, I feel like... Uh, I don't know. I don't know. 162,000 of nice amount of damage. But it's not enough. I need more than that. I need a lot more than that. I need a lot more than that. Um, what sort of damage, what sort of damage do we receive? Oh, I need someone to like bite me or something. Just, I need it. Like, I, I don't know if our Reaper takes diluted damage because it is Reaper. Reapers generally don't take full damage. They have good damage resistance, but I, I don't really know a good way of finding that out. Let's, um, let's have a little scan once more. See what's in the area. Okay, we got spied. Okay, that's good. 62-68. We'll go to that. That'll be that'll be pretty good. So it should be it's a terrible jump. Um yep, cool. Good enough. I just, I'm trying to avoid the water is all. 62-60. Okay, we're going down to the water. Oh we almost saved it, but not quite. We're just gonna head directly north from here. If I can get off this spino, that'd be great. 62-68. Should be a brute. Oh, let's, just, let's just chew up everything. I mean, it's literally what we got him for, right? He is our killing machine, and he's doing a pretty good job of it so far. 62-68, though. Ooh. I heard some little techno beats down there. I don't know who, who they were coming from, but interesting. 62-68. We're pretty close. A couple extra levels while we're at it. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, my experience buff just wore off, but I'm pretty sure I've got another poop, so that's cool. 
All right, so there should be a broodmother around here somewhere. Like right on top of us or beneath us or around. Should be around here somewhere. Did I run straight past it? Broodmother. Where are you, mate? Let me just get some, uh, get some height so we can see what we're looking for. I don't know where the, I don't know where it is. I'm not seeing any eight-legged freaks other than crabs. And they're pretty freakish themselves. I don't got to go north. It should be like right, right here somewhere. Right? Pretty sure. Unless you like despawned. It happens. It happens. It definitely does happen. Oh, he did despawn. He must have fallen out the map or something. That is so annoying. There is an Indominus Rex. Oh, gosh. I just... Oh, okay. 5850. All right, let's go up there. It's a little bit further, but it's it's okay. It's it's not all over just yet. There is a chance still. Oh, there's a Kraken. Ooh, I can test him. Maybe we test our guy against the Kraken. It's probably going to get horribly wrong. Um, should we just see how he goes? If he can't take the Kraken, he ain't going to take on. Ah, put it away. Oh gosh. Oh gosh, he does so much damage. Okay, I forgot the Kraken is an absolute machine. Okay, I forgot that we... <laughs> I forgot that we cheesed the Kraken. Oh gosh, that's bad news then. That's terrible news then. If I can't take the Kraken down... Well, like... Well, I don't have a... This guy doesn't have ranged attacks the same way the Manticore did, basically. So, yeah. Wow. Okay, now he's mincing me. Yeah, that's bad. Maybe I don't have enough levels in health, potentially. Probably. That probably makes a lot of sense, as a matter of fact. But, yeah, that's bad news. That is very bad news. I think our Reaper here... I was hoping, like I said, that the Reaper was going to have damage reduction. And he might not take, like, the full force of damage when fighting some of these guys. But the fact we're just taking 50,000 a hit from the Kraken. That's bad news. It's, uh, it's, it's kind of like the nail in the coffin, to be honest. It's kind of... I've lost all hope, basically. <laughs> I've lost all faith and all hope. I think we are indeed going to have to turn our attention to what we kind of expected. What we what we were almost going to tame up yesterday. I'm, of course, talking about the Dodo Wyvern. But I'm glad we tried this out anyways. Because look at him. He's still a beast. He just doesn't have that survival instinct. Maybe he's just... Maybe he was just raised wrong. Maybe I brought him up wrong. Focus too much on health, not enough on... Sorry, on damage. Damage dealings, not enough on health. I'd almost guarantee it, as a matter of fact. In case you're wondering what we're doing running up here, by the way. I'm looking for... That Indominus Rex. It was meant to be... At like 50-50... It's meant to be like right here somewhere. Probably it was ran straight past him like I run straight past everything. Though. Let's be honest. Alright, one last check. Or, you know, he fell through the map. Probably did that, to be honest. 58.50. Oh, I'm at the wrong location. All right. All right. We're going home. We're going back to base, okay? It wasn't meant to be. What can I say? What can I say? It just, it just wasn't. It just wasn't. It just wasn't. That's it. All right, mate. Let's just sneak through, everybody. I'll drop you here. And now I'm going to my manticore. I'm, I'm going to go and do it. We're going to go grab our Manticore. We're going to go sling some poison darts at a Dodo Wyvern. And I'm hoping that he is the answer to our problems. Because if he isn't, I don't have an answer to our problems. And I would like my problems to be answered. So, come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Come here. Oh, come on. Try. There we go. All right. Nice, 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 nice. All right. I know exactly where to go as well. It's the, We're literally... Uh, we're going to do it yesterday. I got distracted. And then we got pregnant. Then we had a baby. Baby was a disappointment. Let's go and finish what the original plan was. I, I'm joking. I'm joking. The baby was not a disappointment. It just... It just disappointed me. But he's not a disappointment. I don't know what I'm saying. Let's have a look, hey? Where is... Zido the Waven? 31, 33 and a half. Or 32, 33 and a half. So, he should be... Should be. Is he in the snow? Probably under the map, let's be honest. 30. Oh, we're in the laggy part of the map, I just realized as well. Um, okay, we should be around here somewhere. Where is that flappy bird? 
half wav and half dodo. I'm not seeing it. I'm not seeing it. I think this is literally where we tamed one another time as well. It's kind of funny that. 31 and a half, 33.4. Oh, hold on a second. It should be up here then. 31 and a half. And then 33.4. He's literally in the snowy area. Or he's under the map. I don't know. I, he's, he's meant to be like right here. There is a cave beneath us. But this is also a really laggy part of the map. And I'll show you why. He's definitely in here, isn't he? We have a... Yeah, there he is. There he is. Hey, buddy. Do you want to come out? Do you want to come out? <laughs> oh my gosh, it's so laggy in here. These stupid die bears. Um, don't know why I haven't nothing to do with me. What if I hit him with a few little... A few little darts? Can't even hit him. Oh yeah, he's coming. All right, all right. Yep, okay. Do not hit water. Do not hit water. Do not hit water. If I hit water, I'm going to get dismounted and I'm going to die. Um, I can't escape. Ah, I'm stuck. Oh no. Oh no. Come on, come on, come on. Can I get out? Oh no. Okay. You know what? I guess we're doing this here. I guess we're doing this right here, buddy. <laughs> this wasn't my intention, but this is how we're going to have to do it. All right. There we go. There we go. A few more little hits. I'd hope no dire bears are going to like get in the way of this, but you're asleep. Good night. Good night, old, old buddy pal. There you go. No piranhas or no nothing messing with anything. Let's drop that in there. And we've got our dodo wife. That was such a disaster. But we got there eventually. That's all that matters. <laughs> all right. Manticore, you can go home. I need to explore the potentials of a level. I don't even see what level my guy is. Is he a high level? Level 1,242 dodo wyvern. So I'm talking about. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And we've even got rainbow poop. Oh yeah. All right. Lightning blast so far looking pretty good if you ask me. Nice. He's also got fire breaths. I don't know how strong. Well, we're using fire breath on a literally a dinosaur made of fire. Probably not super effective, but okay. Let's leave them alone. The guys actually, you know what? Let's just nibble them. We'll just give them a little bit of a bite. Um, 10,000 damage on a Reaper, but that's fine because, like I said, they have damage reduction unless you tame them. They don't have damage reduction when they're yours, apparently. Um, fire Breath, though, was looking pretty good. Our Bite is looking very good. Only 50,000 damage out of it, though. We also got Poison Blast, so that's kind of nice. This guy here... Oh, I haven't even... Oh, I didn't use my... I didn't use my thing. Wait, did I? No, there we go. Okay. Now we're getting our experience buff. All right, let's quickly deal with the Ancient Rex. In fact, I can't remember. Do Ancient Rex actually give good experience? Because I feel like they don't. <laughs> I think we've made this mistake like 10 times in the past. I'm pretty sure they're actually really disappointing. Um, you know what? I don't need to fight you. I'll fight somebody else. Right after I put some levels into speed first. Because I do want my guy here to be kind of fast. I do want him to have a good chunk of health. And I do want to... I do want him to have a bit of speed, damage, whatever it is. Anyways, let's have a look. Let's find, let's, let's mass level up this guy as quick as we possibly can. Um, that's pretty close. Ah! Ah! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Uh, excuse me? Excuse me? What are you? And why did you, how did you dismount me from my, wait, what? No, he did it again! All right, mate. I need you to, I need you to take this thing down. I have no... What is that? What is this? Somehow... Oh, God. I'm so dead. Why? Data Wyvern, why are you not defending me? Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Ancient Wreck. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Leave me alone. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Like, I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm strong when I'm on my... Oh, my gosh. We are absolutely cornered. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I gotta get back to my Dodo Wyvern. I don't even know where my Dodo Wyvern is. Uh, let's just run it up here. What is with this? What is this banshee thing? I guess we'll never know because it's dead. But good on you, buddy. Good on you. You did it. <laughs> what was it? What are you? Wrap it to Banshee Wyvern. I was just thinking it was screaming like a banshee, but I, I guess it was. Legit a banshee. Wow. Okay, well, that was fun. 
as a fun little distraction. Let's get some levels, hey? Let's get this guy nice and strong. Oh, Glacial Giga here does not mind me nibbling his back for some reason. Thank you very much, buddy. I appreciate you. Uh, now, let's get back to business. Let's get back to what we we're actually doing. We we're scanning, looking for something nearby. It's not terrible. Looking for something. Okay. A phoenix at 2050. All right, that's actually not too far away at all. In fact, I think there was a Dodo Rex. Sorry, I think there's a Dodo Wyvern. I think there was a dragon and then also a phoenix kind of in this vicinity. So we could kill a couple, a couple little level givers while we're out here. But uh, hey, we got 62 up our sleeve already. Let's throw some speed. Yeah, let's do it. So just for context or for, for comparison's sake, what is that? Tribe Mech Knight? Also, Tribe Chief. Look at these guys give me good experience. Oh, oh, he's got some crazy damage reduction. All right, how about you? No, you had nothing. <laughs> how about you? Can I lightning? Oh, oh, oh. All right, buddy. I see how it is. Oh, all right. All right, fine. Why? Okay. He's got some pretty... He's actually... Oh, he's lighting me up. All right, it's cool. Okay, health potions. That's all right. All right, my lightning blast. His lightning seems to be this guy's weakness or not. I don't even know. All the way. Either way, this guy's... Yeah, nah, stuff that. That guy's too strong for me. Or I'm just really weak. I don't know. Wow. Okay, that, that thing was a force to reckon, be reckon with. That was craziness. But here's our little Phoenix buddy that we were looking for. So let's go and get him. I'm looking for some, uh, some easy experience. Buddy, would you be keen to provide that to me? I'd be really, really appreciative. Thank you very much. <laughs> What's that? 50 levels? 130 of them, baby. That's what I'm talking about. And yep, they're all going into melee damage. You know it. You know it. Doesn't even need to be said. Get them all in there and see what our Dota Wyvern here can do. As I was saying, though, we uh, previously gave him 1.5 thousand percent movement speed. Our previous Dodo Wyvern, which, well, I guess all those levels now are going to go into melee damage. So it's going to be a uh, nice difference. Nice change up. That's some pretty good bite damage, especially on a flyer. That's what I wanted to see. 10,000 from a lightning blast. Even better. We could actually go and fight that Kraken, I reckon, if I wanted to. Um, how? Oh, oh, hold on. Now that we've got all those levels in melee damage, can we take down the little human chief here? I actually don't know. My fire, well... Can't even look downwards at him. What dealt all the damage to him before? Because all right, now nah, here we go. Here we go. All right, this is working. I mean, it's it's a little bit. Yeah, it's not ideal, but now I gotta take him down. I gotta do it. If I actually lose this Dodo Wyvern, which we are currently in the process of, I'm gonna be distraught. Um, he had to do me well down below half health, which is a little bit of a concern. But we'll just keep doing what we're doing. We got him over halfway down. Yeah, I'm, I'm honestly not sure if this guy's what we're looking for either. I have no clue if this Dodo Wyvern is our answer to taking down those like end game bosses, but we are gonna try it's exactly what we're gonna do. That's all we can do really. Got six more levels from that. I was honestly expecting maybe to get some extra levels, but no, that's it. All right. Well, he's not maxed out, but I'm pretty content with where he's currently at. I am going to take him back to base. And I'm going to wrap him in cotton wool and some bubble wrap to make sure that he's protected and he doesn't get himself into trouble. <laughs> oh, this place is an absolute disaster. And guys, we're going to end this one right here. If you did enjoy the video, please go ahead, punch that thumbs up, make it rain, those thumbs ups. But until next time, keep on smiling. Have a fantastic day and I'll catch you next time. Bye. Good.